what's up youtube it's curly victoria i am back with another video if you guys are new to my channel thanks for tuning in and if you've already been subscribed thanks for coming back so i literally just took a shower trying to get dressed for the day i'm just gonna be all super casual but i just wanted to get on here and say top of the morning to you guys so basically i'm gonna put myself on a time schedule to get out the house it's 10:07. Um, today is going to be like more of a green day where I'm going to be consuming a lot of my green foods, healthiness and stuff like that. It's also Friday. I have a lot of things to get done on my schedule today. Um, my face feels amazing right now. I just washed my face and it's like drying so I can put my serum on. But what we're going to do is I'm going to grab some, um, hair, skin, and nail vitamins, and then I'm going to take my probiotics. You guys know I do this every day. Remember, I told you guys my um, one-a-day multivitamins were literally not a go. These were disgusting. I can't believe they're sold because they make me sick to my stomach, literally. And I'm not the only person who said this. Several, like, people I know, but also my friend, we were just having a conversation about this vitamin, um, and also said he got sick from them, too, so one a day let me show you what they look like just in case you're a person who has who gets sick quick be careful with these and they're not evaluated by the drug the drug administration so that might be also another reason why they're not all that great because they're not haven't been evaluated but anyway hair skin and nails is what we're taking then we're also going to take a probiotic y'all know i take the raw probiotics for women which really helps with the gut health this is how I get my day started I normally follow this by a glass of water but for now um we're just going to I'm gonna pop open a let me see we're gonna pop open one of these which is a organic sparkling water I'm gonna throw a straw in here just so I can take these down really quickly I was going to do regular water, but I want to do detox water and I haven't prepared it, so I'm not going to do that right now. And I'm going to take, so I'm going to take both of these. Hmm. Normally I will drink a complete full glass behind that of water, just regular water. But for now we just need it to flush those down into the system. The next thing I'm actually going to have... And today we'll be continuing our cleanup is I'm about to drink some celery juice, which y'all know how this is, but give me a second because I need to grab my glass. Let me see if I should sit down or not. Let me see, does that make me look too short for the camera? It does. Okay, so yeah, like I was saying, um, celery juice is not the tastiest. I know some people are gonna, oh, celery juice is just so delicious. I do it every morning. I do drink celery juice like often, like in the mornings on an empty stomach. I haven't eaten anything. It's 10 o'clock in the morning. Um, it has its maximum benefits on an empty stomach. So with me taking a probiotic, excuse me with me taking my hair skin and nail vitamins now i'm gonna be drinking my celery juice um it's like i'm putting all these nutrients and things like that in my body but also i'm really working my gut first thing in the morning um i'm a type of person who don't really eat in the morning i've always been like this for years since i was like younger and um i really don't eat in the mornings um i just don't find myself super hungry in the morning and when I do eat in the morning I'll go for something that's a little bit more healthier um maybe a piece of fruit or I'll go for like some oatmeal or something like that but I normally don't eat in the mornings so what I like to do is take that time to get all of the nutrients into my body into my body that I might not get throughout the day so I start with a probiotic a multivitamin and then a lot of times my hair skin and nail vitamin so today I think when I'm out I'm gonna be looking for another multivitamin because the one that I have was literally like a temporary replacement because mine had sold out but now it's like I can't even use them because they're disgusting so or they make me feel disgusting so I'm gonna be taking the time to drink this this morning which just some TMI FYI if you drink celery juice y'all and don't drink this before you got some more. Sorry the um storage 
have filled up but yeah if you are drinking celery juice i keep on i'm sitting on like my knees are on this i have to find a way to prop y'all up because i'm on a like a stool and i keep changing my position but i need to sit y'all up on something i think that does a little bit but anyway celery juice is not like oh it's so good it's so good it's this and that no but what you want to do is make sure you're not on the way to anywhere that you really have to be so if you got sis if you got a meeting at 9 30 don't be trying to uh drink no celery juice at 8 45 okay because celery juice has different effects on people a lot of times it does clean you out it will send you to the toilet maybe once you know um, other times, like if your your body might not send you to the toilet at that moment, but both ways, I've always felt like with celery juice, be prepared not to leave your house within the first hour or two, just in case your stomach starts to upset or, you know, it just ba basically generates a bowel movement. Just be prepared not. That's why it's better in the morning, first thing on an empty stomach, but it's almost like just walk around, keep doing what you're doing around your house, get your things gathered. I know I have errands to run, I got a lot of stuff to do today. Um, but go ahead and just get your, your body ready to prepare it for this, so let's go. And then I brush my teeth, so it just makes it taste 10 times worse. Um, uh, I got my assignment done last night for school, so I'm super excited about that. If you're new to the channel, thanks for tuning in. If you've already been subscribed, thanks for coming back. So, kind of my, um, a, a, like, kind of morning routine telling you guys what I'm going to be doing today. Also, this morning I weighed in at 150.6 pounds. Yesterday was 150.3 or 4. So, basically, I keep fluctuating somewhere between 148, 150. Um... I am going to really be focusing on detoxifying my body over these next 30 days. Like I told you guys this before, I have been eating, you know, not eating bad or anything like that, but still just really honing in and focusing. So today I'm thinking about having a nice luscious salad. I'm probably also going to have, um, so I'll have a salad. I'll probably have a green smoothie. I'm drinking my green celery juice now but today will be a green day i have asparagus that i've been talking y'all's head off about this week let me check to see if these things even still good they're still good but they're barely making it so i think i'm gonna they kind of mm. well, when is the expiration date baby because these might be expired they might be expired baby let's see I see the dates up here, but I can barely make out. No, I don't think that's supposed to be the expiration date. I just think. I don't see an expiration date, y'all. Oops, I, they kind of stink to me, but I don't think they're like, I don't think they're expired yet. Cause it's a certain way they start to look to me when they're expired, but they're not looking that way right now, but I'm definitely not seeing the date. Like I see the, yeah, the date is not up here. This is really weird. Like I know I've seen the date on here when I first bought these somewhere because I always check my grocery dates. I really do. Now it's making me feel like, should I just trash these? Cause I'm not, the date is not popping out to me like it did in the beginning. Anyway. They smell like butt. I might trash these and just get some new ones. I don't know. Or maybe I'll cook them, and if they taste weird, then throw them away before I just throw them away. But, you know, I got a lot of, like, produce in my refrigerator, a lot of greens, and produce goes fast. So, you kind of got to make it when you got it, because it might be leaving. So, yeah, um, before I get, like, moving around and cleaning, my goal is to finish this, but...
tastes even nastier because my toothpaste bro brushed my teeth like not that long ago and I still taste my toothpaste but anyway before I start cleaning and stuff like that because I'm that person who like when I'm working on something I always find myself like walking away from my drink or my food or something like that sometimes so I'm trying to make myself drink all that celery juice before I start to you know get into what I need to get into for the morning um but yeah because that's the last thing you want is to be walking away from celery juice especially like when you know you don't want it that's what makes it even but you know some stuff it's good for you it's just what I do the things that are best for you don't always taste the best I'm big on that I know that um I'm a type of person too I mean, I know celery juice is not the best, but the fact that I literally am doing this on, like, a mouth that was just toothbrush, toothpaste, it's like disgusting, it's disgusting. But, yeah, and I'm the type of person when something has benefits for your body and it does something for you, I'm not going to sit here and, like, doctor it up with so many different sweeteners and things like that because you take away the benefits of the actual, like, purpose of what it does. So like how you guys might be in a grocery store and you see a celery stalk, it's literally like that. Like basically as though it was blended up and made into a drink. Nothing more, nothing less. Like maybe a little squeeze of lemon, but that's it. There's not like, oh, there's sugar in this. There's that. So it's kind of like not, it's bitter. It's, I don't know how to explain it. When I first like started drinking celery juice and even sometimes now, for some reason, it gives me a three second um, taste of pickle juice. Not entirely, but something, the aftermath or something about uh, celery juice reminds me a quick second of pickle juice. I don't know. I think it's the aftertaste. brain freeze I normally don't add ice but for whatever reason I think because I put the celery juice in the side door of the refrigerator it didn't get as cold as it usually does when I sit it on the shelf in the refrigerator so I wanted it to be a little cooler so I added ice but typically I don't add ice typically I don't drink this when my teeth are brushed like so today was a little bit of a different day but when I do drink it I drink that much so and it can get pricey I think that celery juice is like ten dollars that I have um but yeah so I have mega cucumbers in the refrigerator and then I have salad too so I probably will have and sometimes I put my smart bacon which is the vegan version of bacon into my salad to give myself a little extra protein but I have some organic let me show y'all I have the organic girl um, baby uh, spring mix that basically has um, a whole mixture of vegetables so there's like I mean a whole mixture of the salad types so there's like the arugula there's like um, I think I know there's baby spinach I think there also might be like romaine is there romaine in this one but basically it's a mixture and the thing about it that I like about these it expired this expires January 22nd so I got some time but the thing I like about this salad opposed to like the bag salad or the other salads is this salad before packaged is washed three times so they wash it three times and then they package it so obviously you know that's really good because you know more than likely anything that has gotten on these salad leaves has been rinsed off now you can go ahead and rinse your salad off also you know at home as another precautionary if you'd like but just knowing that it has been washed three times over that's a good feeling when you're eating a salad you know what I mean and then I'm probably gonna just take like a handful or more of this probably a handful and a half later and then I'm gonna take one of my cucumbers well there that goes I'll get it oh this these are my avocados I thought these are my cucumbers these are about it um I just got these and they're not even ready to go yet I do have some spinach that's about a day old 
um oh this cucumber looks like it needs to go so i probably will stop by and get some more cucumbers today but i was gonna cut this cucumber up um i'll probably rinse this off and just use this for my detox water instead of eating because it does look a little shriveled in certain places on here so i probably will just cut a little bit up rinse it off and drop it in some detox water instead of eating it with my salad but when i do eat my salad for the day kind of see yeah i need more cucumbers when i eat my salad for the day i'm gonna end up buying more cucumbers and throwing cucumbers probably in the salad if i'm out and about i'm probably gonna stop by one of these places i go to and grab my salad broccoli broccoli baby so i picked up some uh, mashed potatoes well i have potatoes here too like the whole potatoes but i picked up some mashed potatoes yesterday and they are literally i'm going to whip those up with some vegan butter and um they're just regular old mashed potatoes they don't have any like the type i got doesn't have any milk in them they don't have any of the no bacon no none of that you know how they have the flavor it's just plain potatoes so when i doctor them up i will use my own seasoning such as garlic um and then i'll use um vegan butter to kind of give them a buttery taste and then I probably will make me some uh, like a handful of broccoli and then I'll probably make me like like just a little side of something else I don't know maybe I have a couple strips of smart bacon just to give myself some protein but that's pretty much where we're at weight update weight um so yeah I'm about basically like 20 pounds roughly away from my goals to getting back to the 120. So um, that's what we're going to be aiming to do. I know this video went a little bit longer, but I just wanted to get on here and talk to you guys about my day and then just get it started. Um, and I'll see y'all in a little later. Let's just end this video. And if I make another video, it'll just be another video. It's only a little something But why does it feel like it's true something?